So I invite you to take three deep in-breaths, Neshimot HaMokot, to go inside, to go into our Neshamot, our interiority. Just breathe with me, three deep in-breaths. If you feel comfortable, close your eyes so we help our concentration to go inside. We are going to pay attention to the breathing. When we set our kavana, our intention into one thing, the mind slows down. We are able to pay attention to the soap opera that our mind is. Because our mind produces thoughts, the thoughts produce emotions, the emotions produce reactions. And we lose ourselves in those jungle of thoughts and emotions and we react many times to things that are just in our mind. So to go, the, the act of going back to our breath, our focus of attention is a rebellion against the randomness of our thoughts and emotions to go back to our core, to go back to our neshama and to stand still in the place of our core. What in the Hasidic tradition is called the Shoresh HaNeshama, the, the, the root of our soul. So stay there. Pay attention to your breath. If the song of the birds come through the mic, you can pay attention to the birds. In silence with me. A 
and the mind is going to wander off, bring it back to the sound of the birds or the breathing. One of the quality of thoughts that come up are judgments, a running commentary about life or what are you doing, what is this, anything that distracts you. <coughs> so come back, come back again and again to your soul to the silence, to the breathing, or the birds. Today I would like to pay attention to an introduction of a very powerful prayer that we say here in the morning. It's an introduction to Psalm 145, and it's the Ashrei. The Ashrei that says, Ashrei Yoshbei Vetecha Udi Aleluha Sela. Happy are those who dwell in your house. They are ever praising you. Ashrei Yoshvei. Happy are those who dwell. But I'm going to translate it literally. Happy are those who sit. Wow. Happy are those who have the courage in this treadmill called life of obligations, of schedules, of emails, to sit. Happy are those who sit. Who sit to take a deep breath <coughs> and to connect with the soul. Sorry. <coughs> Happy are those who, who sit, who say, I'm going to take a few minutes a day to sit, to go back to the center, to go back to my soul, to go back to the most elevated part of me, maybe the divine aspect that is in the root of our soul. <coughs> so happy are those who do that. And I would have had to have the courage, that have the courage to stop. To stop. To stop for a few minutes to slow down. Ashrei Yoshvei, happy are those who sit, who sit and dwell. Yoshvei Beitechan, sit in your house, the divine. And if you have problems with the God idea, just to sit with the highest aspiration of your soul, with the Nitzot Hashem, with the spark of the divine in you. with that that redeems our humanity. Happy are those who sit in that place for a few moments every day to recalibrate.
So we are going to chant this introduction to Psalm 145. Ashre Yoshave Vete Sing with me, Ashere Yoshave Vete O Yaleluha Sela O Yaleluha Sela Ashere Yoshave Happy are those who sit and from there they elevate a song of Alleluia. Of Alleluia, que felices que son los que tienen la capacidad de sentarse y parar la tremenda máquina que absorbe nuestra vida y allí centrarse y allí elevarse a Asherei. back to our breath and remember that the capacity to sit and to dwell in your neshama it's a decision many times when I was in my office in New York I would light a candle and just for five minutes sit and breathe chant or simply pay attention to my breath, to go back to my center, to that core, to that place. And when we feel ready, we open our eyes. I'm so grateful to be with you. <coughs> I will find a consistency in my ideas to do this three times a week. So I hope to be together. So wonderful because I see people from New York, from Argentina, from Chile, from Israel, my niece from Jerusalem. So I feel very honored and blessed.
to share these moments of meditation and mindfulness with you. Have a wonderful, wonderful day.